Hey guys, welcome back. Okay, so just a quick reminder of how when we set goals, like we decide we want something in our life and we think about it and we just want it even more the more we think about it. And then we kind of realize that we need to take certain steps to get that thing that we desire, that dream that we have. It could be a better relationship. It could be a better connection with people. It could be less stress. It could be to learn to relax, to love yourself more. It could be uh, a million things. It could be a target at work. It could be absolutely anything that you feel is missing from your life and you need to work to get it. Don't forget to set a goal. And then don't forget to figure out the how. How do I get to that target? Now, when we figure out how to get to that target, it could be a short-term goal. It could be something that you want to see results in the next week or two, or it could be long-term results, something you want to follow up on in a month, in two months, six months, a year maybe. It could be absolutely as big of a dream or a project that you want it to be. But do not forget to come back and evaluate what you've done. Is what I'm doing working? Are the steps that I've chosen to take to get there actually working? If they aren't working, then you need to rethink a few things through. What could I change? Or if my relationships aren't to the extent or the, um, they're not of the quality I expected them to be, having made these changes, I obviously need to make some more changes do things differently. When you're working with something and what you're doing is not working, don't hesitate to change what you're doing or how you're doing it. The quicker you change, the quicker you will find a new solution. And the first change you may fail, the second change you may fail, it doesn't matter. Just fail quickly so you can have time to choose another solution. Now, the point is to always come back and see how well things are working out. Does this work for me? Do I do more of this or do I do less of this? Do I need a new plan? Whatever you think, but you have to come back and see where you are stuck. Because a lot of people set out with, a, they begin with a plan, they know what they want, and then three months down the line, they've dropped it all and it's not working, so I am not doing any more of this. It doesn't work that way. Sometimes there is a bit of struggle. No one said that everything is easy in life. But the struggle may not be as big as you think. So just give yourself time to actually think things through. And stop and ask yourself, what could I change? What's that small change that I might do that will give me that big difference? Okay? So that's it for this weekend. Miracle moments. If you're looking to make a change in your life and you don't know how. If you're looking... If you feel that there is something that needs to be fixed, even though I don't believe that things are broken in our life or that we're broken, I believe that things are actually set out in a divine order. But sometimes there are things that feel too overwhelming for some of us, or there are things that feel um, too confusing, or maybe we're not in the right state to handle them. Miracle Moments, Elena Sofoglos is here to help you. I wish you guys a great weekend, live with passion, and don't forget, any change you make could benefit you, so don't be afraid of change. Bye, guys.